That's right, and tonight parents got to tour the school, meet teachers, and share in the excitement of having an elementary school back in the community. It took a lot of engineering and creativity to resurrect this school. And now, that's exactly what Washington Elementary will be offering students. The Midtown School has gone high tech. So our kids will be on iPads, they'll be on Chromebooks um, and MacBooks. And there's an emphasis on STEAM, which stands for... Science, Technology, Engineering, Art, and Math. I think it's going to be really a lot more hands-on than a typical school, and I think it's going to be great for him. In 2013, the school was one of seven Sacramento City Unified Schools that closed due to budget cuts but demand in the area has changed. We've got a lot of new housing in the pipeline, some of it getting built nearby. But we also have, I think, a lot of people who see the potential for bringing their families back in, just in general, to Midtown. The school is drawing families from as far away as Davis and Rancho Cordova, and parents who live and work in Midtown are relieved to once again have a neighborhood school. It's very close to both my husband's work in Midtown and mine in downtown, so we're looking forward to it. This year, the school will only accept 200 students, and from there, the plan is to grow over the years. We're eager to see how the children do in this environment. And to honor the past, the school is now home of the mighty locomotives. The first day is September 1st. Reporting live in Sacramento, I'm Dana Griffin, KCRA 3 News.